Hi, this is Lady Starlight, and I'm really excited about uh, the Classic Rock Wall of Honors Award. And it's really nice to have a publication like Classic Rock, you know, for a younger generation especially, who don't, weren't there, so you can get a, you know, just expose them to new old bands and also new new bands that carry on the, um, the tradition that all the classic bands did. So, it's great. Who do you feel is the future of classic rock? The, my favorite new band is Rival Sons. They, you know, embody everything about all the classic bands, Zeppelin, um, Deep Purple, Montrose, everybody who's amazing, but like bring a fresh twist to it and just rock out. Good songs, great vocalists, good band. They're just amazing. I think they really have a chance to to really reel a new audience into the into the old classics as well. Obviously you know if you're DJing, who is what is the one song that you're asked to DJ to play whenever you're DJing? Um <laughs> question. I would say Iron Man Black Sabbath. Not many DJs would go and play that, so you've got a niche. <laughs> so what is it when when you're when you're DJing and you you, you you play a song, how do you what is it that when you put on a classic classic rock tune, what is it that grabs people? Why why is that work? I think it's just um, I think the most important thing as a DJ is to bring across to your audience that you enjoy the music and just really that is actually what gets most people into it is, is the DJ brain energy because great songs are great songs but you know if you have somebody bringing the energy and really getting it through and also spinning vinyl as I do it makes a huge difference in the way that people feel about the music because you hear this depth to it so it's just it, nothing compares to vinyl so finally what is it about classic rock as a genre of music that is so enduring why is it going to go on forever um, it was just I think people will never get tired of it was the time when true musicians were actually popular the better of a musician you were the more popular you were so unfortunately that's missing today so I think that that will always be what what makes classic rock classic is that it's not about what people look like it's not about who's doing your PR <laughs> it's about your talent